Hello, Facebook. We are back. It's Miss Allison. Adelaide. And Phoenix. Yeah, we're all together again today. Let's see if I can adjust this so we can see more Phoenix. There we go. Um, thank you all for joining us. I see we already have a couple thumbs up and a, and a heart. Thank you so much. Um, let us know you're here by commenting so we can say hi to you. And uh, I am Allison Brandon, the founder and director of Wonderland Performing Arts. And during this time that we are all um, staying at home, we hop on Facebook Live every weekday at 2 p.m. to do an active listening reading. And today's book is by Aaron Blaby. I didn't realize what a fan of his I was, but now that I'm paying attention, um, I'm a big fan. So uh, this is called Pig the Star. This is our book for today. Yes, and Adelaide <laughs> is already demonstrating our active listening words that we're going to be listening for. So for pig, what are we going to do? We're going to snort. And for star, what are we going to do? Oh, our star pose. Yes, looking like a star. And then um, there's also a character in this book named Trevor. What is Trevor, Adelaide? A weenie dog. He's a weenie dog. And so for Trevor, what are we going to do? Um, and also mom's watching. Oh, mom's watching. Hey, mom. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to pant like a puppy dog. And uh, Pig is also a dog. But what kind of dog is he? Do you know? A bulldog? No, close. Pug. A pug. Hi. He's a pug. So he's a pug named Pig. So instead of panting for him, we're going to make a um, pig noise. Um, <laughs> why do we do active listening, you guys? So, um, first of all, because people are at, stuck at home and um, they don't, sometimes they don't have anything to do. Yeah, so and we're trying to we keep practice. you guys entertained. And also, um, you need to... And also, you, you learn how to listen and and um, and talk when you're not talking and follow directions. Following directions, listening actively for specific words. And why is this important, Phoenix? Because when we do theater, we have to be actively listening so that we don't miss anything. Correct. So if you're off stage <laughs> and it's almost your time to go on, you have to know what's going on on the stage to know when to make your entrance. You also um, need to be on top of cue lines. So if someone says a line and then your line is next, you need to be listening so that you can say your line on time. Um, I'm hoping that there is not a delay on your end the way there is on my end. I'm not quite synced up. Um, Mom, can you let us know if there's a delay on your end? waiting to see if she'll comment. Mm -hmm. She'll let us know, hopefully. Okay. Um, all right, so be sure to tell us hi. Be sure to comment if you want to comment on our book, on our reading today, and I hope you have fun playing along with us. So here we go. Pig the Star <laughs> by Aaron Blavey. Ooh. Oh, this is an advertisement. <laughs> Looks fine. Okay, great. Thanks, Mom. This is an advertisement, and it says, Doggy Stars Pet Photography, Priceless Memories at a Low, Low Price, Photo Shoot Call Sheet, On Set, 9 a.m., Star Number 1, Pig, in parentheses, Pug, Star Number 2, it says Trevor Dachshund, but it's crossed out, and it says, Pig, 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 Pig. I wonder why it says that. Let's see. Pick the star. The dedication says, for that lovely cast back in 99. I'm just so sorry. <laughs> I'd like to know the story behind that. Okay, here we go. Pig was a pug, and I'm sorry to say, he just loved attention. He'd show off all day. He'd shout, look at me. I'm the best. I'm a star. But then came the day that he took it too far. <laughs> too far, man. <babe>. Too far. <laughs> yes, Trevor and Pig had a big photo shoot. They wore little costumes. They looked really cute. <laughs> they act more funny than cute. <laughs> the 
We've got a box of props. Oh, fabulous. <laughs> Isn't this fun? Giggled Trevor <laughs> with glee. But Pig pushed right past him and yelled, Look at me! <laughs> Aren't I just fabulous? Aren't I divine? Now back off, Salami. These costumes are mine. Have to share them in a photo shoot. Phoenix, I believe you have a, a photo of yourself. I do. Similar to this. I do indeed. <laughs> I love that. Yes, Pig ruled the photos. He hogged every shot. He whispered to Trevor, I'm in and you're not. And under the lights, as the camera went snap, Pig felt like a rock star. Where's my star? <laughs> oh, yeah, you're doing half the star. <laughs> and started to rap. Yo, I'm a star, y'all. Yeah, dog, I'm the best. Now, get me a donut, you sausage-shaped pest. <laughs> Making noises? <laughs> but then something happened that changed the whole shoot. Hi, dog. The man with the camera said, That dog is cute. That is cute. Who's he pointing to? Trevor! Trevor! Trevor. <laughs> hmm. Wow! Trevor's a star! The photographer said, Pig couldn't believe it. And then he saw red. <gasps> what does that mean when you see red? You mad. You mad. He shrieked, I'm the star. And he knocked Trevor flat. But Trev bumped his rocket. And the rocket went flat. <laughs> Gotta turn the page first. Now say it. Flip. No, flat. <laughs> uh oh, who's under the rocket? <gasps> Wait, watch. <laughs> These days it's different, I'm happy to say. Pig's dreadful <laughs> antics have all gone away. He's not such a show off. He's not such a swine, and although it annoys him, uh, he lets Trevor shine. <laughs> so, what did we learn from this book? That you don't always have to be the star. You can let someone win. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can let someone else have a turn in the spotlight, huh? Yeah? Because you know what? Sometimes it's fun to watch other people shine. Yeah. Right? Sometimes it's not your turn to be the star. Um, so that was our active listening. Um, Adelaide, do you want to tell everybody why you are dressed so fancy today? Because it's the day before my birthday. Yes. Adelaide mm -hmm. has a birthday coming up tomorrow. <laughs> How old are you going to be? I can't believe it. The little baby's turning six. Shall we sing happy birthday? Here we go. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Adelaide. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, and we're going to be celebrating so much over here, um, putting lots of it on my personal story. We're making a cake from scratch. Hey, Mom. How's it going? Uh, Mom said, yay. <laughs> uh, so um, thanks for helping us wish Addie a happy birthday. If you want to leave some comments for her, I know that she would love that. Um, so you might notice that today I have on my uh, the top of my screen that summer camp registration is open. Um, I have our website in the bottom uh, part of our screen and so below. 
If you want to um, come to Wonderland for summer camp, it's a great time to start signing up for that because hopefully everything will be back to normal and hunky-dory very soon. And uh, our summer camps are for ages three and a half to 12. Ages three and a half to four can come for half a day from nine to 12. And ages five to six and seven to 12, they're in two different age groups, but they can come for the full day, nine to three. And at camp, if, um, we offer a variety of uh, a lot of different things that we offer at Wonderland. So camp is a really special experience. We do improv, storytelling. We dress up in costumes and create stories from uh, inspired by our costumes or props that we're using or puppets. We do music and movement. Um, we teach the basics of acting and we also do crafts. And what we do all week long is we rehearse uh, for ages five and up, we rehearse a little performance to show our friends and family on the Friday. So it's really, really fun. Um, and we have registration open right now. If you have any questions, you can email us straight from the website on our contact us page and also if you like uh, what we're doing right now we are just trying to put a lot of content out there samples of our classes and things completely for free if you like what we're doing like our active listening um, also at 11 a.m. and 5 p.m. we're gonna have a variety of different classes in the ways of music directing acting um, dance Monday through Friday uh, if you like that then you can um, send us whatever you think um, is appropriate to our Venmo account. You can search for it. It's at Wonderland Performing Arts. And just make a little donation there so we can keep our doors our doors open during this, this crazy time. And uh, we hope you all have a wonderful day. And uh, stay safe. Stay home. Bye. Bye. Bye.